Hey guys, Troy here, and that doesn't look right. It's nice just starting out with this. Yes. <clears throat> Put something that looks kind of realistic in there. Um, so Troy here, and here I've got another transformer. Not necessarily a tutorial. I'm working on Treads tutorial. It's going to be quite a big tutorial. So yeah, but. Besides that, all my Transformers, you know how to build. Unfortunately, you don't know how to build any of my puzzle boxes. So, um, this one, it was kind of scrapped together. Um, I had to take apart that random Transformer. I didn't really like it. Like, here's part of it. Just like that. The rest is basically just scrap metal. I even took about the head, so no more of that guy. So, <laughs> um, so this guy I'm about to present, he's kind of cool. He looks pretty basic, but he's got a few twists to him. So let's get on it. Get that out of the way. I still like that thing. And here he is. This is, hmm, you know what, guys, this is on an on-site, um, discovery, this guy's name is going to be Bumper, um, so Bumper's actually pretty cool, um, he's got a rather quirky style on him, um, not too special, but kind of special in my eyes. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it about him. Um, I'm trying to hook him up with a little antenna, make him look a little cooler while I talk about him. So, here we go. Here's his little cute antenna. Now he can be re listen. No, his passengers can listen to. Uh, music and jam along if they want to so bumper is a simple little car he's, he's actually uh been jacked up quite a bit um he's got tail lights uh wheels unfortunately the wheels don't do anything especially all uh, right they did do something in transformation but the car was pretty messed up allow me to show you um so what it looked like was um let me just get some sample uh uh one by sixes and put some one by ones on it Try not to take apart the actual thing. Um, so actually what it looked like was... If you just take these off, it just looks like a car without wheels. And then, here's the original way of doing it. Now that, what, I. Uh, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty messed up looking. Um, and what the, you, these hinge up, and then rotate, then fold, fold like that against the back of the robot. Imagine this guy just walking around. But yeah, it was pretty messed up, so that's why I transferred to these, these things, and... As you can see, it's a huge, huge difference of parts. So, yeah. There is Bumper in his little car mode. Jacked up car mode, but oh well. Uh, yeah, so. Yeah, let's get on to trans- Oh! Size comparisons. I do not have any size comparisons. 
Here's muscle. Because I can. There's muscle. Um. Yeah, that's basically all I have. Here's a minifigure for... Oh, boy. Here's a minifigure for comparison. And that guy blew apart. Um, here's the old wheel assembly, I guess you could say. And... Yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's get on to transformation. Okay, guys. So to transform this guy, um, what you're going to do is... How do I start this? Okay, so what you're going to do, fold these panels. You know what? Scrap that, guys. What you're going to do is going to take this piece... Gonna take these off. Gonna put this on. And you're gonna put a nice black 2x2 two two underneath it, just like this. Make it a little simpler. Also, make it a little more jacked up. Um. There we go. So, now what you're going to do is you're going to fold these panels down. Fold these panels down a little bit. Rotate this around. Like that. And that should reveal, basically, what you're going to... What's going to form into what. This is not a parts forming transformer. I hate those transformers. So, then you're going to flip this up and fold this all the way around. Then I guess you can fold out the legs. He's got very little legs. Like that. Get this angled in the correct position. And there he is in robot mode. I'm just kidding. This guy is very incomplete. So we still need to do more. You're going to flip this whole section up and around. Um, then make it go as far as it can. And then take this whole section and rotate it around. Just like that. Then just kind of fold it down at the waist. Fold the antenna down just like that. Straighten out the head, hinge these pieces down, fold out this piece to become the hand, um, do the same on the other side, and there he, there is Bumper, uh, if his stub little feet will just stand up. Um, <laughs> so here is Bumper in his robot mode. So Bumper is kind of cool. He's actually pretty smaller than my original guy that I made him from and various other parts. Um, so yeah, he actually looks pretty good. I like how his wheels, um, not are... On his back, not only on his back, but, um, they're not like just this, they're like this. And this is the same way that it would have been with this, it's just very awkward looking in robot mode. Um, so he's got, uh, humongous arms, they start from here, go all the way down to here, and in comparison... Very short legs slash feet. I mean, most of his leg is... His leg starts from this black piece and ends at the foot. So he's going to be waddling all over the place like a duck, I guess. So... Uh, he can hold a gun. You just have to angle it in the right way. Make him fall over. I'm just kidding. 
Uh, what's a good gun? Um, I guess we'll just use the good old standard stud shooter. Just put, just put a random gun in his hand, and you'll have him complete. Uh, you'll have him complete. Just like that, holding a gun very low to where nobody can see it. And then he can just blow his head, their head off without anybody noticing. So, getting that out of his hand, getting him kind of all straightened out. Let's get into size comparisons. Uh, oh boy. Scoot the camera back a little bit, because this guy's kind of tall, but not that tall. So, let's get this minifigure back together. So, here he is with a minifigure. Pretty tall. Um, here he is with... Lever uh scrap heap. I almost called them leverage for some reason. I should call him hinge because of the multiple robot hinge robot arms and hinges he uses up. So they're about the same height if and of course if you just like press his head down. If you want his head down like that, then once you build scrap heap then Scrap Heap would be taller. So let's get him out of the way. Let's quickly transform Muscle. Once again, Muscle has not... Well, Muscle has not been updated. And I don't plan to update him except for the many changes I added to him um, from the previous builder. Just transform him real quick. Come on, you can do it. There. Okay. Take his flame out, put it in his hand. Ah, forget it. Forget it. Um, so... Ah, there. And here he is next to Muscle. Now, this guy is actually not standing up straight, um... I kind of have him like this because of his ginormous and heavy backpack. So, yeah. That's basically it for Bumper. So, I will see you guys in the next video.